Happy Central Park. Welcome to this glittering edition of Famous Homes and Hideaways. First up, Tanya Tucker has built one of the most successful careers in country music. I've had some great songs, but Delta Dawn is always going to be my favorite. Today, we meet the star at her magnificent Tennessee mansion. And we check you into Merv Griffin's Resort and Givenchy Spa for some French-inspired pampering. Coming up... Start planning the guest list for the incredible parties you'll want to throw in this spectacular California home. Plus, we take you on a tour of an incomparable DuPont family estate. So join us today on Famous Homes and Hideaways as we experience luxury at its finest. of six, Tanya Tucker told her father she was going to be a singer. Armed with talent and perseverance, she showcased her abilities in Nashville, and by the age of 13, she had her first hit in Delta Dawn. At the age of 15, she had a Grammy nomination, her first greatest hits album, and a Rolling Stone cover. She's been racking up hits and awards ever since. Join me now for a down-home visit with Tanya Tucker at her Tennessee mansion. Nashville, Tennessee is the country music capital of the world. Singers and musicians from all over flock to this legendary mecca to catch that lucky break that could make them superstars. One of country music's most enduring performers is Tanya Tucker. No matter how far she travels, Tanya loves coming home to her Tennessee mansion. What is it that you feel when you walk into this home after you've been on the road for weeks? It's always a welcome sight for me. I've, we have a uh, coming up the road, you know, you make this turn, and you don't see the house until you make that big turn. And uh, once you go around that corner, it, it just jumps out at you. It really takes my breath away every time I see it. And it's almost like every time it's the first time, and and uh, it, re it feels like home. I mean, it's hard to believe that a place like this is so big to, to feel like home. The sprawling 20-room, 27,000-square-foot home boasts 10 bathrooms and 10 fireplaces. There's a lot of pieces in the house that, you know, I've purchased throughout my travels, and, uh, you know, it's very eclectic. It says Tanya. It, it, it yeah. really does. Well, good, because that's, that, that's what I wanted to, want to say. <laughs> it's, it's such a spacious kitchen. It's a great kitchen, uh, you know, especially with the island in the middle. I love working there and making my cookies and stuff like that. This is a fantastic space. Yeah, it's a, it's a great uh, family room. Tanya shares her home with her three children and her fiancé, Jerry. When did you first know that music was your destiny? Probably around eight, because uh, um, I don't remember ever not singing. I was always singing. She had the talent and the drive, but the road to stardom had its ups and downs. Sometimes I get angry because I didn't get started earlier, you know, because my dad brought me to Nashville the first time when I was nine. Some of those memories, is, 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 as tough as they were uh, when they were happening, you know, the things that were happening to me, uh, they're the best memories of now for me to recall. Hey, what's a cowgirl say? Hee-haw. <laughs> Hee-haw. <laughs> this is the, sort of the, uh, uh, Grand Central Station right yeah. here. Yeah. 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 That's it's a great, great way to have a master bedroom, to have the kids so comfortable coming in. Yeah, our, our, our new furniture is on order, but it's, it's going to be coming in. But, you know, I just have some pieces like this, this chair. It's rocked all my children to sleep, so... I decided I would put it in my bedroom and rock me to sleep. So uh, I put it in here, and it's really wonderful to sit back and listen and, and feel the fire and watch TV or, or just uh, write down my memoirs, things like that. Your daughter's name is Presley, mm -hmm. and I'm betting that has something to do with your yeah. uh, fascination and affection for Elvis Presley. Absolutely. Um, uh, he was always my number one, and, and uh, I... I I, ch I chose that name a long time ago, uh, when I was a kid, probably. And when I, we met, he knew who I was. In fact, was a very big fan of mine. And, uh, and later on, I found it. In fact, I think there's a couple of my albums that were his favorite albums in, in Graceland now. And I see here you have your Elvis shrine. <laughs> <laughs> well, these are just a few things that uh, people have given me. Uh, they know that I really love Elvis. I've had some great songs, but Delta Dawn is always going to be my favorite. You know, 30 albums later, uh, it's still would be a record today. And those kind of songs you want, as many as you get. Delta Dawn, what's that fire you have on? A lot of people look to you for inspiration, because you did go through some dark days. Mm -hmm. You've been very honest in your autobiography. Mm -hmm. When you look back on that now, how do you feel about it? 
you know, I learned a lot from that experience, and uh, and I hope that I helped teach a few other people a few things as well, you know, and because you can get through it. It's um, it's just like you said, the days are dark, but uh, you, there's sunshine somewhere. Tanya's future looks bright. She's working on a new album. There are still many adventures on Tanya's musical horizon. Do you ever see yourself doing a family song group? Oh, well, you know what? That's not too far-fetched, I tell you. Uh, as musical as uh, all my children are, uh, it's probably a good idea. You mean the Carter you know, family? Especially like a Christmas album or something, <laughs> right. you know, which I have never done, which is... It's nice to have been in the business 30, 35 years and, and realize that there's a few things I haven't done yet. Not one to rest on her laurels, Tanya keeps going forward, and country music fans are with her every step of the way. From Tanya Tucker's Tennessee estate, we head to sunny Southern California. If you want to live large, you need...